Hello everybody, how you doing today? My name is Nick and welcome to my channel. Please to watch and talk about movies. In this movie reaction, well not any movie reaction, in this show reaction, it's going to be Wednesday episode 2. Very excited to hop into this one. I just finished the first episode and I decided I wanted to watch two episodes of this tonight. Because honestly, the first episode was so good. Just the introduction of Wednesday, the introduction of the whole school and everything. I'm very intrigued with the premise of this. And like I mentioned at the end of the episode 1 review, for right now, I think the main like things I'm so interested in seeing in this series is definitely Wednesday and also the different components of the school, like with the werewolves and vampires and everything. Like I'm very curious about like the magic in way behind the school the history of it but in terms of the monsters it's definitely an intriguing premise but i just do not know enough to be like so attached to that premise of it but based off the uh preview that i saw at the end of episode one it was only like 10 seconds i watched because to be honest i don't want to be spoiled for the show a lot but from what i saw in it it seems like wednesday is going to try to figure out the mystery of this monster and who it is and like what it's doing so that's definitely intriguing to me but once again i'm very excited to see like what wednesday does in terms of like the school and like her relationship with the roommate what's all gonna happen there so lots of questions i have i'm just very excited to hop into this series once again Again, if you guys do want to see the full interactions to this video or really access my videos, you guys can check out my Patreon first thing in the description down below. And also a special thank you to these patrons who pledge the video credit to above. I really appreciate the support. And let's just hop into it Wednesday episode two. This story is about to take a dark turn. Has it already taken a dark turn kind of? <laughs> Usually I love dark turns, but not this one. You think we missed something? I say we double back, sweet. Oh wait, are they trying to look for the boy's body or for the monster? How could you miss a dead body? Because it wasn't there. Nope. <laughs> How could you? <laughs> uh. Maybe it was one of your classmates. Sheriff, I find that question offensive. So you automatically assume that a Nevermore student is the murderer, even though there's no evidence that a crime was even committed. I mean, they're dead right outside the gate of Nevermore. I forgot, you only teach the good outcasts here, right? <laughs> As Wednesday's right there. My guess is Roan ran away. Oh, that's a cool fireplace. I not even noticed that. But they haven't heard from him either. Dead people are notoriously bad at returning calls. This monster wasn't a bear or some other wild animal? I've hibernated with grizzlies. I know the difference. You've hibernated with grizzlies? I don't know. Actually, I would like to speak to Sheriff Galpin. Alone. Everything is off the record. Play nice. I'm shocked she's actually letting her go... Like, talk to him alone. Someone is trying to cover up Rowan's murder. Is that your professional opinion as the daughter of a murderer? My father is twice the man you are. Adams, it's been a long night and I'm tired of your game. I'm telling the truth. Yeah, but he's not going to believe her just because of her dad's past. Because you and I both know that there's a monster out there. He so does. You're the one that even told him, like, the bear thing just as a cover-up story. <laughs> like, you know it's something else. Sheriff, what? You're gonna want to see this. Oh, another murder? Wait, why? Edgar Allan Poe said, believe nothing you hear and half of what you see. How is that possible? Clearly, Nevermore's most famous alumni picked that up. <laughs> he just like waves high. <laughs> oh, that is crazy. How is he alive? He, he must have like had a fake body or something. Why should I bother telling you anything? Yeah, you don't believe You've her. already decided I'm lying. It's okay to be confused about things. Don't try and lure me into one of your psychological traps. No one is trying to trap you. Yeah, you are. <laughs> oh, you're trying to get it to open up. They lead to feelings, which trigger tears. I don't do tears. Wednesday, part of the reason your parents sent you to Nevermore is so that you could find your people. Become part of a larger community. I don't think anyone is like her. Yeah, <laughs> she also likes being alone. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. Social tendencies might be motivated by fear of rejection. If you were to reject me right now, I would not be upset. I'm at, I would actually be so shocked if the therapist actually got to her. I mean, maybe by the end, <laughs> but I doubt it. You know, when you ran off last night at the Harvest Festival, I wasn't sure what happened. Everyone, including your father, believes I made it all up. But she didn't. I believe you. He's actually just so sweet to her. <laughs> I'm, I'm kind of shocked. <laughs> just considering like how she is to other people. It's so nice when like someone just kind of is just nice to her. This kitty is taking no prisoners. If Bianca Barclay wins again this year, I will literally- Wait, win to what? I would pay money to see that. <laughs> uh, little quips. <laughs> I'm so glad you decided to stay. I thought you wanted your single room back. Thing gives a killer neck massage. Oh, she likes Thing. So? I witnessed his murder, Enid. It's just, we all saw him this morning. 
very much like. Yeah, it had to be a cover up or something. Which leads me to believe I've been losing my mind. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> What's Rowan's story? Xavier Thorpe's roommate? You know, if you had a cell phone, you could just text him and ask him. What is the poke up anyway? Park canoe race? Park foot chase? No rules. Oh, that sounds like fun. Oh, wait, no rules. Yeah. Want to take a stab at being social? I do like stabbing. <laughs> of course you do. <laughs> Besides, it'll cut into my writing time. She's honestly no just such a treat in a way. <laughs> as silly as it sounds, like I just I love her so much. I've always hated the expression, write what you know. But when your life becomes a twisted mystery. Yeah, it's actually so much of a bigger mystery than I thought. Oh, what is that? I need to speak with Rowan. I can't find him. It won't be possible, I'm afraid. He's been expelled. For what? Why? He'll be on the first train out this afternoon. What were you doing out in the woods with him in the first place? I told you already. Are they trying to cover it up? Like, did he actually die? And maybe that's like a doppelganger type thing? <laughs> it's like a... Like, that is so weird. Why would you just expel him after that just happened? Vision, didn't you? He knows? I realized you might be having them when we passed by the accident and he knew that... Wow, she knows that quickly? Your mother started having visions around your age. Oh, that's why she gave with the W pin. First. I honestly she thought she, she be, like she may have just heard about that. <laughs> but like, okay, so she really experienced them too. Clearly the person withholding information here is you. May I go now? Not until you've picked your extracurricular activity. Oh, you have to pick an extracurricular? It needs to be well-rounded. I prefer to remain sharp-edged. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm shocked. She actually, she actually has to join a club. Thoughtful. You need to have picked one by the end of the day. Weems is clearly trying to keep tabs on me. Keep an eye on Roman. Oh, was she gonna join choir? Oh, please tell me she is. <laughs> That'd be great. Let's get this audition over with. Uh, what are you? Alto, soprano, or just loco? <laughs> What was that? A note only dogs can hear. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, she she could be good at archery. Alamo just says be happy, just showing her like so like serious. <laughs> Ever shot a bone arrow before? Only on live targets. Okay, pull back and let it fly. When's the last time you saw your roommate, Rowan? The Harvest Festival. I haven't talked to him since. The last couple weeks, he's been more erratic. Telekinesis can mess with your head, you know, he's... Oh, he has telekinesis? So what's the deal with you and Tyler? Yeah, word of advice, steer clear. Why, because Why? he's a normie? Because Tyler and his friends are a bunch of jerks. At least I'm not an elitist snob. Yeah, <laughs> that is true. <laughs> Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, she is so worried about her. Like, it seems almost like she's scared of her. Are you oh, wait, interested why? in the ancient art of beekeeping? <laughs> Eugene. Oh, that's a club. The Nevermore Hummers. Wednesday. Wednesday Adams. The hive life isn't for everyone. Is it for anyone except you? <laughs> I would be too. <laughs> Are you willing to feel the sting? They're nature's perfect community, all working together to achieve a common goal. Oh, why is him there? So one of the few ecosystems in which female. He's like, wait, where'd you go? <laughs> Rowan, we need to talk. Wednesday. Where did you get that drawing? I just went into the woods to clear my head. You shouldn't be here. Yeah, back off and leave me alone. There is something they're so hiding. Like, I'm actually so much more intrigued by this mystery now. <laughs> Even at the end of the first episode, I was like, eh, like, like, it's pretty interesting. But like, now I'm really intrigued. Oh, yeah, thing was on the end of the car. Oh, he just walks in like straight. <laughs> I thought I thought he was trying to hide in a way. <laughs> he 
it was just someone else. Oh, and now things can be so confused. Come on, then you gotta put it together. What? Wait, it's her? Oh, she's trying to cover it up. How do you lose him in a bathroom with oh no windows? Oh my. <laughs> a lefty wouldn't have failed me. Oh, come on, he tried. Finally made a friend. Even if it is a plant. I go for quality over quantity. <laughs> oh, I'm serious. Her comebacks are just too good. There's an open spot next to me. If you can stand sitting that close to an elitist snob. That's kind of weird. She's the only one who wears a black, like, coat. Like, no one else has a black uniform. Oh. Oh. Oh, that is terrifying. I doubt Wednesday is impressed by your tricks, Mr. Thorpe. I'm scared. <laughs> I'm terrified of that. Oh, that spider. Oh, no. Oh, please. <laughs> oh, it wasn't real. Okay. Who can tell us the name of this beauty? Yeah, of course Dendro she Phylax can. Dendro and Denii. Nice job, Wednesday. <laughs> Otherwise known as the Ghost uh, Orchid. First discovered on the Isle of Wight in 1854. Oh, this is too great. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> One upper. Looks like you may have competition for first chair, Bianca. <laughs> it's able to thrive in even the most hostile environments. But its mere presence can change the ecosystem. Nothing a weed whacker couldn't fix. You can most certainly try. Are we still talking about flowers? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, the rivalry between these two is so engaging. These aren't the only carnivores in class today. <laughs> You still believe there's a creature out there, don't you? I heard you and Santiago talking. I think it's a Nevermore kid. Oh, I don't think Wednesday is a problem. Tight lipped about your progress. Yeah, it's called doctor patient confidentiality. I'm about a little father son confidentiality. What are you two yakking about? We talk about mom. Remember her? Uh, he just never acknowledges it. I, I was hoping we could fire up the grill and then catch the big game. Yeah, so he just feels like neglected by his father. Weems has been watching me like a vulture circling a carcass. And you want me to cover so that you can return to the scene of a crime that didn't happen? It did, though. It did. <laughs> it so happened. He's mad at you. Why is he mad? He's the one who screwed up with Rowan. All I know is that we spent an hour giving each other manis, and he really opened up. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Oh, how did you get that from Thing? <laughs> and he would do anything for you. Go apologize and I'll reconsider helping you. That's so funny. Thing actually, like, became close to the roommate. <laughs> Just somehow. I snapped at you. I'll check my tone in the future. That is so sweet. She actually kind of apologized to him in a way. Oh, oh I know. <laughs> He's like, that wasn't good enough. What is it that you want? Hand cream, nail buffer, new cuticle scissors. I know I'm stubborn, single-minded, and obsessive. But those are all traits of great writers. Yes, and serial killers. Oh my, <laughs> why? <laughs> I have nothing to get off of my chest, and I'm not submitting to your emotional blackmail. Fine. When Rowan showed me this, it confirmed my greatest fear. That I'm going to be responsible for something terrible. Not good terrible like Ivan. Bad terrible. And I can't let that happen. That's why I need to find out the truth. Oh. <laughs> Breathe a word of this to anyone and I will end you. <laughs> He's like, okay. <laughs> oh, thing. Payback is gonna be a bitch. I'd expect nothing less. Blab and I will squeeze you like a honeycomb. Snitches get stung. It's hive code. Besides, I should be thanking you. I thought he was gonna say snitches get stitches. <laughs> The chance that Enid ever becomes romantically interested in you is less than 1%. Oh, so I'm still gonna shot? <laughs> <laughs> oh, what an optimistic guy. <laughs> in ancient times, peace detect fear, but you don't need to worry, because mm -hmm. I have a very big smoker, and I handle it like a pro. Trying to impress her. <laughs> Thank you.
I honestly kind of like like the fact that Wednesday just has like some of these moments of. Is that Tyler? Oh, okay. I didn't want Elvis to pick up on your scent. Thanks. Well, that perks being a part-time barista. I assume your father didn't bring the bloodhound to play fetch. Wait, what really happened the other night at the festival? Look, I swear I won't say anything to my dad. Proceeded to use his telekinesis to try and choke me to death. That's when this monster came out of the shadows and gutted him. Oh. I'm glad he actually believes her. It's so nice. <laughs> like, she actually has someone in a way. I came out here to find something that can prove he was murdered and that I haven't lost my mind yet. Oh, good. The glasses. Oh, I thought that she was going to find nothing because the principal would have hidden up the track so well. Cover up. Oh, so he heard him. Oh, so he must know something more than what he told her earlier. The cover was darker, more like a day-old contusion. Keep looking. Most sneak in to make out. I accidentally walked in on two vampires fanging. I can't unsee that. What does that mean, fanging? <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> Have you seen this before? It's a watermark from a book I'm looking for. The nightshades. Like the deadly flower. My mother is a carnivorous plant aficionado. I assume I get my red thumb from her. Are you and your mother close? I've been here a year and a half, and I still feel like an outsider. Is that because you're the only normie on the staff? Oh, she's the only normie? There's still a handful of teachers who will barely acknowledge me. That's actually a shame. I act as if I don't care for people to psych me. I secretly enjoy it. I thought she was about to say I really do care. <laughs> the ability to not let others define you. It's a gift. And if you ever need anyone to talk to, the door to the conservatory is I wonder if she'll actually like open up to her more than the therapist. It seemed like she actually like struck a more natural conversation with her. Yeah, now Wednesday's got to question him. That purple book has got to be around here somewhere. Why is there a drawing of her? Was that on Rowan's side of the bed or the other side? No, that was on the other side. What is that? Just a mask? You're not supposed to be up here. I'm sorry about Rowan. Now you guys used to be close. Since when did you give a damn about Rowan? Oh, she's trying to figure it out too. Do something to Wednesday. Oh. Isn't that why you've been following her around like an eager-eyed puppy? Or is there something more? Maybe it's because she hasn't tried to manipulate me. Oh, does he have a crush on her? She treats you like crap and you can't get enough. Okay, why are you so fixated on Wednesday? Because she thinks she's better than everyone else. No, it's because she's such a threat to you. Can't wait to crush Ophelia Hall tomorrow and watch her werewolf roommate crumble. You were good together, Xavier. Why is she trying to get back together with him though? Is that just how you wanted me to feel? Wednesday Adams is not the girl of your dreams. She's the stuff of your nightmares. I mean, she honestly looks a little bit menacing too. <laughs> so, uh, uh. <laughs> Literally having a heart attack right now. Yoko is in the infirmary. What happened? Wait, Yoko? Garlic bread incident at dinner. Oh, that was her plan. It wasn't an accident. Bianca's behind it. How do you know? Doesn't matter. You and I are going to take her down tomorrow. That's amazing. <laughs> I love that. Uh, that's her extracurricular activity. Going to do that for me? It's not for you, but she's willing to do it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, but mostly you're doing it because we're friends, right? <laughs> Tell me how she. Can I love how she does not even acknowledge it. The past two years, no other boat has made it across the lake and back without sinking. Oh, using her powers. What are her powers, though? She is a siren, which makes her master of the water. Oh, so she controls the water. I need to beat her at her own game. Oh, you can do that. <laughs> like, if she controls the water, can you? <laughs> I mean, Wednesday will come up with something. She's such a mastermind. We're all set. Good. Things in position. You want to tell me what you two were up to all night? And spoil the surprise? Speaking of surprises, your costume's in the tent. 
costume? costume? Oh, she's not gonna wear. Oh. <laughs> oh, she actually wore it. I thought for sure she was gonna be like, no, I'm not wearing. Oh, that's too good. I'm actually so curious though. If there's there's no rules. Then like, is she is a siren girl the most like powerful person like that can do this? Oh, she has a crush on him. Focus. For the record, I don't believe I'm better than everyone else. Just that I'm better than you. <laughs> that was an amazing line. <laughs> oh, seriously, I'm loving this show so much. First team to cross the finish line with their flag oh, wins the cup and help. bragging rights for a year, as well as some special privileges. Oh, you get special privileges for winning. Like besides the trophy, you actually get privileges at the school <laughs> just for winning. <laughs> Wait, what's he doing? Is he a shark or something? Oh, he's a merman. Oh, no way. <laughs> oh, that is crazy. <laughs> that is insane. Thing. Oh, what's in their boat? That's amazing. Oh, that's amazing. She knew. Oh, that's so great. Let's go. It's over here. Are they supposed to be like Team Jokers? <laughs> like, even though I thought they were like Team Dead People. I need you to distract a couple of Jokers. That's why he did that. I just thought he was gonna like make them lose a little bit of time. Oh, that is such a, oh. That's the first time a convulsion has like made her, oh, what is happening? Oh, was that like the ghost of... No, because that was Joseph. Hurry up, we have to go! Yo, what's going on? Just ask myself, WWWD. What would Wednesday do? <laughs> oh, that's gonna be the new saying, isn't it? <laughs> Two teams of go Fox And the Black Cat. Oh, does she not like the fact that they're winning? Yeah, she so doesn't. Oh, is that actually gonna work? He got out of the net, no. Yeah, go, go, go thing. He like actually knocked him out. I'm shocked. Thing has that much strength. I mean, of course he does. <laughs> He's probably me. <laughs> That's actually amazing. She actually helped them out. They actually won. <laughs> well, thanks to Thing too. Thing did a lot. Minute, you kind of got to the whole school spirit thing. You didn't tell me it was a dark, vengeful spirit. Celebrate those values that all outcasts share community, perseverance. 
Okay, maybe, maybe she wasn't, like, upset they were gonna win. I don't know why I thought she gave a look like, dang it, I don't like this. <laughs> I don't like the fact they're winning. <laughs> Oh, I thought that was about to just open into like a trap door. Oh, is that the book? Girls want to know if you want to hang out later? Oh, come on, it won't kill you. I'll think about it. I actually hope she does find a, like a group of friends that can like understand her in a way, <laughs> like deal with her. <laughs> Although it probably will be really hard. Good mother. My mother and I are two entirely different people slash species slash everything. I think you guys are way more similar than you care to admit, though. This time, Ophelia Hall won the Poe Cup. Your mother captain the team. I was her co-pilot. Oh, she was her mom's co-pilot. Like you think. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but that's kind of crazy. So the Dean actually was like friends with their mom then. He tried his hardest. I mean, he cheated a lot for them. Well, not even cheated, because <laughs> you can do whatever you want in that. The answer is staring you right in the face. Don't worry, Edgar Allan. I see your sanctimonious smirk, because it's not a single riddle. Rather, each line is its own separate one. Oh, really? Instead of moon, sun, two. Its leaves weep to the ground. Willow, it melts in the sun. Ice, it's beginning and end never found. Circle, every rule has one. That's actually crazy. She just covered it. Like, she just solved all those so fast. Oh, snap. Oh, snap twice. Oh, secret door, secret door. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, secret door. That's actually such a great little add-on though, like snap twice with the Adams Family like little uh, theme song <laughs> type thing. I'm assuming the Dean knows about this, right? She has to. Oh, that's where the guy was to find the book. Yeah, the book's Secret definitely societies, there. Hidden libraries. Oh wait, are they all purple? Yeah, they're all the same. But the minute I inch towards the truth, luckily, I'm not afraid of the dark. Oh, no, you can't end it there. Okay, I, I might have to watch the next episode, actually. <laughs> like, I, it can end there. Okay, buddy, so that was the end of me watching Wednesday, episode two. This one's gonna be a little bit shorter just because I really wanna watch that third episode, but this episode was definitely amazing. I love the Poke Cup. Just the little events at the school are honestly amazing to me. I don't know, it makes me feel like it's like such a magical school in a way. <laughs> just like some of the things that they do in these competitions. The Merman was amazing to see and also how things just like took him on. I love that so much. The whole thing with Wednesday and just like, once again, her attitude, her demeanor, it feels so much like the Wednesday from the show, from the 91 movie, which I just so appreciate and I, I cannot get enough of Wednesday like she makes me laugh so much even though it's like so disturbing some of the times what she's saying it's just the way she says it in the way she says it with like such a straight face I don't know it, it makes me just so uncomfortable sometimes but also just like laugh sometimes if that makes sense but I'm actually liking a roommate a lot more in this episode I I think she's probably gonna be like a main character or like side main character I would assume throughout this series but I'm really enjoying her development I will say the little villain of the school thing I like her rivalry with Wednesday especially the line where she she says I not need to beat everyone I just need to beat you because that is kind of true like she just got so under Wednesday's skin she's not even care about being the best she just wants to beat her <laughs> so I just I love the whole relationship between Wednesday and like the kids from the school it's all really coming together a lot more the end of that episode was so mind-blowing to me though I never actually thought that it was a secret door but the fact that it actually was at the end and now she's kidnapped by someone I'm assuming that might be the Dean, honestly. Just because the Dean tried to cover up Rowan's murder, so I can so see the Dean, like, trying to not let Wednesday be exposed to, like, this secret society. But the end of that episode was definitely a cliffhanger, so I'm very excited to check out the third episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this reaction once again. I'll see you guys in the next episode.